What's up guys, Moonlight150 here with part 23 of my Pokemon Y2 Randomizer Nuzlocke. And it's actually been quite a while since I've recorded, it's been more than a week. Uh, job got hectic and they I switched up my schedule so I work m multiple long hours now, so... I just got tired every time I was home and I was awake for maybe three hours and I'm like, okay, time to go to bed. And I was doing other things other than playing, but anyway, we are back. And we're just gonna continue on. I did a little bit of grinding before recording this. Got everyone just up a few levels, not too many. Definitely need to do some more, but we'll worry about that later. Uh, so I went over to that creepy mansion, did the whole puzzle thing. Nothing really too interesting, worth noting. I got the Lunar Wing for a Cresselia event, I'm guessing. Because that's what the Lunar lunar Wing belongs to, is Cresselia. I'm guessing that's a post-game event. So nothing really to bother us, or deal with that we have to. Uh, so we're just gonna head into Reversal Mountain. Sadly, not a new area. It's technically, like this outside area and inside the mountain is considered the same thing. So, no new encounters, but I don't really need new encounters. I'm actually kind of liking our team right now. Yeah, we have some weaknesses, uh, but, you know, what team doesn't when you're given wild, when your Pokemon selection is very limited? It's kind of funny that every time someone does do a randomizer, it's always a Nuzlocke, so your limit, so your like options are always so limited. But imagine playing through just a regular game, like however you would with a randomizer on. Oh goody, a lagging tail. Uh, that'd be kind of crazy. Like you, you'd constantly be want to be switching around your team because you're like, oh, I just found this Pokemon. I found this Pokemon. Oh hey Bianca. So I want to investigate. I remember nothing about this. I'm starting to th think that, oh, oh, that is like my third odd incense. I'm starting to think I did not complete Black 2, because I own the Black 2 cartridge. But I'm starting to think I did not complete it, because I do not remember this at all, or my memory is just as terrible as I keep saying it is. And I'm glad these are not our encounters for the route, because I would not want either of these. Granted, Psyduck's not too bad. I do need, like, a water type. But still, no. Um, okay, let's just fight her. What you got for me, lady? I think like, this kind of thing means Bianca's gonna be healing our Pokemon, right? So, I can battle as much as I want. As long as anyone doesn't die, we're good. Three Pokemon. Oh, it's a triple battle. Thankfully, nothing too scary. Alright, and speaking of scary, my team is scary looking. <laughs> The intimidate off on that. Uh, it's actually a pretty good matchup. Ooh, wait, Earthquake and Charizard's a flying type. Perfect. Okay, so we Earthquake that, Flame Burst the Shelmet, and Strength the Rubber Raid. Perfect. Odysseus and Charizard are gonna go well together in double battles. Die. Because you're Bug type. Maybe Bug Steel? Possibly. Don't know. I know you're Bug Steel when you evolve. Okay, team up on the Charizard, why don't you? Dive Rimmer, there we go. And I'll just do that. I'll do that. And that. But you're gonna die anyway, Nidorino. Bye! Perfect. Alright. Oh, what's this way? Nothing. Okay. And what's this way? Items, I think I... Mm, not items, Pokemon! Oh, a seal! A seal would be such an interesting Pokemon to have. I don't think I've ever used one or a dugong. Bianca's a Levani, that's not bad. Not bad of a- ooh, hello. Ooh, Judgment! Nice! wonder if anyone can learn that. See, it's 100 base power and 100 accuracy, which is really nice. Ooh, okay, Buttercup, Samson, and the Trader can learn it. And if I remember correctly how it works... This type varies with the kind of plate- okay, so we have a couple plates. 
But the fact that I'm thinking it's normally a normal type move, we can give that to Buttercup and that will be a stab. Which would be really nice. But which plates do we have, actually? We have a Dread Plate, so it could be a Dark type move. Uh, but we have Crunch. Um, we have Insect Plate, so it could be a Bug type move. We have Bug Bite. We have the Zap Plate, so it could be Electro. That, that since we lost Electros, we could kind, we could possibly use that. Wait a minute, is Judgment physical or special? Oh, it's special. No. Any my special Pokemon learn it? It was uh, same. No, they're all the physical attackers. Damn, that sucks. Guess we can't use that. Ooh, Marshtop and Swadloon. I would actually have a hard time picking between these two. Because they're both types we could use. Like, I'm sorry, Exeggutor, but I'm looking for your replacement. I need an actual grass user. Your psychic's nice, but I need grass. Um, but I already have a bug with Scolipede. I think I would take that Marshtop because I need the water. Let's battle these guys. Yeah, I really need to pop in my Black 2 and see... Did I really knock it that far? Did I just, like, drop the game for no reason? Lightbird, Seedra, okay. Nothing really too threatening. That's actually kind of worth that. Levani's good against Seedra. Uh, oh, and the Bug Bite can kill... The Lightbird, let's do that. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Die, Life Bird. Oh, yes. Yay, it's Fox 37. Die, die, die. Perfect. Oh, crit. Poison Point. Yikes, that sucks. I didn't even know Cedric could get Poison Point. Yay, the King's 37. He really needs some HP. Well, I get some HP. Okay, Venomoth. Nido Queen. Ooh, okay. This game just this battle just got a little more interesting. Um Kinda scared to do anything. Uh Earthquake wouldn't hit Venom, so that's kinda pointless. Plus it's resistant with Nido Queen. Which is a ground type. Poison bug grass. I'm just gonna bug bite. Thanks, Levani. Just thanks. Okay, I'm switching out. Oh dear. Oh, that hurts so bad. I forgot Venomoth can learn psychic type moves. I gotta get out of here. Okay, what what hurts Needle Queen? Um, Smaug. I have Surf on him. Plus, if she has Earthquake, it won't hurt uh, Charizard. Thanks again. Bye, Levani. Don't poison me. <laughs> poison? What does Poison thing have like a 20% chance to poison or something like that? Like, seriously. And you have a Finny on. Perfect. Ugh, okay, let's just surf. Oh, Finneon is Storm Drain. This is working a little too good. Gotta get rid of that Nido Queen. Poor Finneon getting bullied. And it's confused, wow. Oh, that sucks. I want to see that Storm Drain boosted Finneon. Okay, you can stop that, please. Ooh, okay, good thing. I'm actually kind of scared now. Oh. Uh, a body slam or a side beam could kill me. Uh... No, I was about to send him out, but I realized side beam's a thing. Nope, let's send out Buttercup. Get that intimidate off, even though all you've been hitting with is me a special time. Actually, no, wait, he has body slam. Oh, I knew you were gonna go for that. Okay. Ooh, cool. Plus one whirlpool. See ya. Finneon just took out a Neo Queen. How often do you see that? Uh, Ice Fang because you're flying type. Okay. Just hit me with a gust. That's fine. 
I'm so glad she's keeping our team healthy, otherwise we have to go back and we're ill and uh that does not do enough. Plus one whirlpool. There we go. Okay. That was a little harder than I thought it would be. But she is keeping, yeah, she's keeping all our guys healthy. Alright, this is where we were. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, I have no idea what I would pick out of these two. So you would be good if it knew any ice time moves, but I think I would prefer Carvana. Once higher level, so it would evolve. Granted, I think both of them are very close to evolving. Let's head out this way. Ooh, items. Yay, smoke ball. Ooh, a hard scale. Where's the move tutor? We could actually probably use that. Oh, I wonder if we could do that to get... Um, Exeggutor, maybe like a... There's nothing here. Ooh, I wonder if we can do that to get like... I remember Exeggutor, Exeggutor could learn Energy Ball. Okay. Um, do I feel like battling you? Oh, Chris, I'll just run into a random Pokemon instead. But yeah, if we could double side up all the way across the sky. Um, yeah, if we can go back and maybe teach someone like a really good needed move. Like, I know it, our Exeggutor is probably the most lacking in moves right now. I think everyone else's move set is pretty decent. Okay. Okay. <laughs> just. Pokemon aplenty. I would easily take the Marshal out of this group, especially because we already have Ching we have Chimeco, which I have no desire to use. Unless my entire team gets wiped out and I have to build a whole new team. That is actually a thing in Nuzlocke, and I think I've even seen I've even seen it happen before in a Nuzlocke, where they blacked out or whited out, whatever you want to call it out. And they just had to like ditch all their Pokemon and just start all over with the Pokemon they had in their reserve. Which, that would be scary from the Pokemon I have my reserve. I mean, there's some decent Pokemon in there, like the Swellow. The Watchog's even kind of decent. Um, I have some terrible Pokemon. Well, they're not terrible Pokemon. They're just badly natured. Um, need Alarm because you're ground type. Oh, nice. Oh, that was a crit. And I flint. Wow. All the hacks. That's what I... That's why, he, that's why you're the king, Skullipede. That is why you're the king. Hey, Smug's 38. Drapion. Dark. Poison, I believe you are. Well, if you're poison type, I can earthquake you. I believe you're dark poison. Yeah. Okay. Oh, talk spikes, that's fine. Yeah, because I, I always get confused about that because he's a bug poison when he's a Skaroopy, but then he evolves and he ditches the bug and becomes a dark type. Which is like a really good typing because the dark type uh, saves him from psychic type moves. But it doesn't save him from Earthquake. Okay, let's get the XP share off Smog because he's now 38. Let's give it to the traitor. He can use some levels. Oh look, we even have the iron play for it to be a steel type move. But it's still special, so we can't use it. Oh, we even have the earth plate. There we go. I need to get rid of some of this stuff. Okay, so what is this special area? I... <laughs> I need to put on a repel. Oh, uh, we can just keep seeing... See, yeah, keep... I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> I don't feel like fighting. Uh, fine, let's go down there. Or we can just keep running into more Pokemon. I have these things called repels, I should be using them. Uh, we're so close to whatever we're supposed to be going to. It's like, why waste it? Even though we still seem to have more of this mountain to explore. 
Do you want to fight, buddy? Yes, you do. But I don't really need you right now because I kind of have Bianca. Granted, why do I have a feeling the minute I go in there, she's going to be like, oh, this is where I wanted to go. And then she's going to abandon me. I'm going to need this doctor to kill all my Pokemon. Okay, your bug poison, right, Parasect? So, Earthquake should hurt you. No, you are not. You are a grass bug, is what I'm guessing. Which means you resisted that earthquake really well. But if you're bug poison, that means poison tail should hurt you. There we go. Ah! Bulky Parasect. It'd be interesting in, like, if I got stuck with like a Parasect in a Nuzlocke. Oh, come on! Crit? Oh, I love you, Odysseus. Alright, you're 38. You're good to go. Let's put someone else up front, I guess. Kinda don't need it, Doc. Alright, let's put Samson up front. Take the lucky egg off him. So let's see what's going on in here. Feels very strange because it be a place where layer. Oh, Heatran! Uh, oh. And we find Heatran right here. That'd be nice. No, <laughs> we get a Cyndaquil in a temple. Okay. Cyndaquil would not be bad to have. Granted, we have Charizard. Actually, no, Tibble would be better to have because the Seismitoad's not bad. It gets wrecked by grass types, but... Ah, I wanna... No? Okay, nothing hidden. Uh... Alright, since she's not abandoning us... Ooh! Snover would be amazing! Both ice and grass? That's what I need! I need a Snover! I need an Obama Snow. Granted, it'd be a Snow over for like another 10 levels. But. Oh, that would be amazing. Can I have a Snow over, please? Alright, after this battle for sure, I'm getting. I'm pulling a rappel out. Oh, wow, an unknown. Imagine if we got stuck with an unknown. We'd spend an episode pretty much just trying to figure out what the hidden power was. Okay, we're definitely putting on a rappel now. No. I know I have some extra pills in here somewhere. There you are. Uh, where to go? Up. There has to be an item like right here. No? Okay. Be like that game. There's an item right there though. Oh, there's so many levels of this mountain. And we just met a special encounter? Oh, dear. You know, I might, might piss off some people, but if these were if this was my encounter, I might just type this up Striker. Let's run. No. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. Guys, I don't want to fight. I really don't want to fight. This is actually scary. Okay, you're leaving me no choice. But I would... If this was my pair... Oh, wow, Ivani. Calm down. Uh, I... <laughs> I, I thought it was going to hit top. Hide again. Let's do a wake-up slap. Nice, we both got crits. But yeah, I think I might have taken the Zeb Strike. Well, no, maybe not because. Another Relic Vase. I got one of these in the freaking Strange House. Okay, that's another double battle. Oh, wow, okay. Double battles everywhere. There's so much battling. Granted, I'm okay with it because. 
It's um We're constantly getting healed, so as long as nothing dies, there's gotta be an item on one of Yep. Binding band. Man, we're getting all these equip items that are just not that useful, yes. Alright, let's just get on with these double battles. There's so many of them. And we're not even going to be fighting both of them. We have to fight them separately. I walked in the wrong spot. Double battle the, the episode, pretty much. Carnivine. Who do I have up front? Oh yeah, Samson. Do I have anything? Yeah, I have Joe Peck on this guy. You can take that, right, Samson? Yeah, okay. Thirty-eight. And the trader's thirty-eight. Awesome. Star Raptor. Oh. Uh, who do I need to take out? I just realized my flying weakness. One, two, three, four things weak to flying. Um, oh, you have Ice Fang. Oh, wait, crap, you might have close combat. Crap, 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 crap. I gotta get out, gotta get out, gotta get out. Plus, that Intimidate's no good. I need to switch out to Charizard. Oh, but I'll get my Intimidate off on you. Ha! But I need to switch out. We could have had a Star Raptor, guys, but no, Toxic Croak had to go and kill it. Ow, it still hurts. Um, it's just Blue Flare. Of course. Don't you dare kill my Charizard. Die. I just realized that's a minus one aerial from the Star Raptor. Imagine if I didn't get that Intimidate off on him. Um, I guess let's just leave it like this for now. It runs 38. And we could have done it where he's, this was a double battle. Granted, I think that would have been a lot scarier, depending on what this guy gets. Because that Star Raptor would have ruined me if given the right situation. So I realize I have a big psychic weakness and a big flying weakness on this team. Crocorock, okay. Uh, I have Wake Up Slap. It's kind of weird to say that Wake Up Slap is actually like a good move. But it is a 70 base power, which is more than Forest Palm. Oh yeah, I think during training he was, he was he wanted to learn Dynamic Punch, I'm like, no, that has such a low accuracy. Good move, but low accuracy. I need more accuracy. Like that, so I could do stuff like that. Bastiodon, I have Earthquake. I love Bastiodon, he's probably one of my favorite fossil Pokemon. Not a really good battler, but I just love him design-wise. Bye, Bastiodon. Oh, yeah, you have Sturdy. Denied. Oh, I'll just Drill Peck him for the fun of it. Gotta get Samson up in high levels because he just has two Sacred Ash. What on earth is the Sacred Ash again? That belongs to the Ho-Oh, right? Something to do with Ho-Oh. Uh, it revives all things to Pokemon and doing so- Wow, that's cool. Granted, we're in a Nuzlocke. Okay, um... Double battle. Then we have to choose, go to left or right. Right, I know, is to another item, I think, so I guess we'll do that first. Two Pokemon each, okay. Licky Licky and Abra. You know, sometimes it actually seems like Pokemon they would actually have is not really randomized. Okay, I need to get rid of that Abra ASAP. Um, Rock Slide. Hopefully, yes, okay, yes, team up on the Abra. He's, he's a threat right now. Never mind! Abra, not much of a threat. I should have gone for the wake-up slap on Licky Licky. 
I really shouldn't have gone for the wake up slap. Um, Galvantula is not that big of a problem, so let's just focus on Licky Licky. Thanks. I have no idea what that move does. Nah, I can take that. Oh, of course. Don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself. Uh, okay, fine, whatever. It has to boost something. Oh, good, good, good boy, Samson. Die. Yes. Thirty-nine. Moving right along in these levels. And the trader's thirty-nine. Finian. How many Pokemon does Bianca have? I'm guessing three. Usually these. Po oh, okay. You have a Gunk Elder too. And well, I do have the Drill Peck, so let's try. Let's go for that, I guess. Yes, beat up on Bianca's Pokemon. I don't need you beating up mine. Not bad. Oh, that was a crit, too. Okay, I'm gonna do something a little ballsy. Never mind. I was either gonna go for Rock Slide or Earthquake because... They're both super effective on Galvantula, but in different ways. Rock Slide hits it on its bug side, and Earthquake kicks it on its electrical side. But I think I'll go... But I think Bug resists ground, so I'm gonna go with Rock Slide. Of course. Don't confuse me, don't confuse me, don't confuse me. There we go. I love Galvangelo. I wish I could have one, but I already have a bug type. Alright. Let's get this off him. Get this off you. Let's put... Definitely gonna give Benedict the EXP share because I just don't want to use him. What I'm... I don't know if I said this or not. Not a thing, but Benedict the Executor is gonna become like what I call a special needs Pokemon. And what I mean by that is he only comes in when he's needed. Like he needs it for the special like psychic or I need something like really special attack heavy. Like I'm not gonna send him out normally. I'm only gonna send him when a situation calls for it. So under cer special circumstances and certain needs. I'm gonna bring him out. Anyway. So he's gonna set there with the XP share. Oh, Granville's 37, Eld's 38. Yeah, let's give him the XP share. I mean, the lucky egg and put him out. I let Granville fall behind. Okay, so let's go over here. It's another battle, I guess. No? Okay. We got two zap plates. Oh, the item randomization on this is terrible. Okay, that's an exit. What's over here? Hey, hey an escape robe. All right. What'd you have to say? You strike me as the type of fizz with the habitat. Let's come on, tell me what kind of Pokemon live in. Uh, still looking at that, huh? Some of the. Okay. Whatever, whatever, guy. I just want out of this cave. I want some new encounters. Ah, uh, now we're out. Undella Town. Yes. You have fun with that. Thought we had more battles to do. It was actually perfect timing. We're about to wrap up the episode. Undella Town. Looks like it's still under construction. Ooh, item. Can we get up there? Power band, yay. It looks like we can get some Pokemon here too. It looks like there's a surfing spot right there. How do I get on the beach? Alright, so let's catch an Undelatown Pokemon and we'll wrap up the episode on that. 
Because this is not considered anything else but Undella Town. Okay, now this is Route 14. But up here is Undella Town. So that's two different encounters we could do. And then there's a route right up here for something else. Uh oh, no! Are you on battle? Dang it! Okay, fine, we'll wrap up this episode by battling Hugh. Give him a nice pounding. Right, another guy. You only have three Pokemon, Hugh? You are a disgrace, but you do have an Aggron. That's kind of scary. So we'll do that, and then I guess we'll go catch these Pokemon in the next episode. We'll get you off with the Intimidate. But I'm going to bring in Charizard. One, because if you have Earthquake, I do not get hit by that. Plus, you are a Steel-type, so I can resist. I can burn you with my Fire. And my Surf. Actually, Surf is probably a better idea. Metal Sound, fine. That lowers special defense. Yeah, but you have a better physical moveset, so why would you do that? Let's Surf. Surfing Charizard. Ah, uh, you yeah. have... Oh, I dodged whatever that move was. I wasn't looking. Of course you have a Hyper Potion. Why wouldn't you have a Hyper Potion? Wow, that does a lot, actually. But, doesn't matter. Have the Surf. Sunflora, nope. I like how you still have the Sunflora. You will always have this Pokemon. I love that I gave that to him. <laughs> wow, you actually took that Sunflora? I don't know- oh, well, you are level 41, but still, you're a Sunflora. I really need to grind up. These guys are getting way too ahead of us. Lilligan- oh, what? why do you have a Lilligan? Maria! Of course. I need- I think I need to give Charizard those lenses that help increase accuracy. And this is bad because that special defense just went up. And Teeter Dance. Great. Don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself. Okay. And you landed the blue flare. Good boy. But it's probably not gonna kill because he raised his special defense with the Quiver Dance. Oh, never mind. Charizard's just awesome. Our little gets really fragile. Alright, well that wraps up this episode. Looks like we actually might have three counters to be able to do here, so... Anyways, let's heal this up so we can... Actually, I don't really need to heal, but... Need to set this for be able to fly. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that other good stuff. And I will see you guys on the next episode where we go get three more encounters. Maybe we can change up our team a little bit. Maybe get rid of that, like, psychic and flying weakness we kind of have. So, I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye.